How to upload projects to GitLab. Good day, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. If you want to upload a project to GitLab, it's not the same as uploading just one or two small files. Uploading a project is uploading like a mass amount of data. So I'm going to show you exactly how you go about it. The first thing you want to do is make sure that you are on GitLab.com and you are signed in to your account and this is what the window looks like on the right hand side now what you want to do is go into your projects and you either want to create a new project or you can just scroll down and you can actually see that we have some existing projects it really doesn't matter which way you go about this we're going to go into one of these existing projects and as you can see over here there are a bunch of options now we're going to leave it just over here for the time being we're going to go now into the folder that we would like to actually upload our project from on our desktop. So on the left hand side, you will see that these are all the files within my folder. My folder is called new GitLab project and it is located on my desktop. Now, what I'm going to do from here is right click in the space of this folder and if you're running on windows 11 you will have this drop down menu if you're running on windows 10 you will have your full menu open up right over here you're going to look for open git bash here and you're going to tap on that now this will allow you to open up this command prompt and we're going to just open up this window on the left hand side so that we can see this properly now the first thing you want to do uh, to initialize this project upload is we want to type in git initialize and we're going to hit enter so right over here it says initialized empty git repository in and then it gives you your path right so the next thing we want to do is we would like to add everything that is in our folder so we're going to upload the entire contents of our project so by doing this we go git space add space full stop and we hit enter right now the next thing we're going to do to check that it is actually being uploaded we're going to go ahead and we're going to type in git space status and we're going to hit enter now right over here it says no commits yet so basically the files have been recognized they've been staged but they have not yet been committed. So these are the files over here. And just for example purposes, there are not a lot of files. The next line of command we're going to put in over here is actually to commit these files. So we're going to go ahead and type in git space commit. And we're going to say space dash m space. We're going to put those double hyphens there and we are going to say new space file and then we are going to just close that up now this will basically allow us to commit those files that we're uploading so what we can do now just to double check that all of this is actually being committed is we can type in git space status and we can hit enter and over here it says on branch master nothing to commit working tree clean which basically means all of this uh, that we've uploaded has been committed so now we want to make sure that we are connecting this to our gitlab project over here so what we need to do now is we need to type in git space remote space add space GitLab and then we're going to hit space and this is now where you need to jump back into your project in gitlab.com so as you can see over there on this page on the right hand side there's a blue button that says code and you can open this up now right at the top there is a clone with https and there's a clone code and right over there you can copy that url now once you've copied that url you can go over here into git bash again we're going to right click and we are going to paste that in there now once you've pasted that it's quite simple we're going to hit enter this step basically registers the project that is incoming but it has not yet uploaded anything so what we want to do over here now is we're going to type in 
git space push space dash u space dash f space gitlab and then we are going to make it the master file and you're going to hit enter and as you've done so there is a new window that's popped up now basically what it wants you to do is connect to gitlab so because we're already open in our browser we're going to go ahead and tap on sign in with your browser you will now just go through the process here of tapping authorize so that you can authorize this connection on the left hand side you can now see that it is uploading uh, it is counting objects it is compressing and it is writing objects so you can see over here that it is 16 percent on the way it is three of 12 files up and it is also giving you a upload speed and its total uh, mass or total amount of data that is actually started uploading ladies and gentlemen you can see now that everything has been uploaded to the actual address and the actual project one that we're looking at now that we were working with and if you want to upload a project that's the way you go about it hope you enjoyed this video if you have any questions or comments you can leave it down below we'll see you in another awesome video